Hello everybody, welcome back to a brand new episode. Tonight we're looking at Wall Street bets and some of the most crazy trades from this week. So if we look logically, there's been some quite large movements in price from certain stocks, meaning people have made huge profits and losses. So please do like and subscribe and we're going to jump straight in with our first trade. So here we have the person who says that they started around the end of May and have reported a huge profit of 716.20%. That is a very nice rise. This person saying that they've made $103,000. Now they're implying that they've started off with around 17, 16,000, slightly less actually, but they're saying that they have made this in such a short period of time and we can see the rises and falls here and it's basically just skyrocketed. Now my prediction is this person might have invested in Tesla, which has been a stock which has been going up quite recently and they have, and they have posted this 13 hours ago, which could potentially have been before the stock market opened. So the stock market hasn't crashed where Tesla has gone down in price. But if you don't know about that, I'm going to talk about Tesla price crash in just a bit because a lot of people on this list have made that mistake today. But we can see here, this is a great trade from this person. They've made a 700%, which is an absolutely huge rise. Perhaps they've invested in many things over a longer period of time, but tech stocks is something that I would suggest or guess that this person has invested in. So that brings us on to our second trader. Now, this person has 102% profit, 102.71 to be exact, and this person has made 63000 $648.70. So this individual is claiming to have started off with quite a large amount, but even then has made a large profit of over 100%. So they've clearly doubled the money and then a bit more. So we can see that this has happened over a longer period of time because this person hasn't really stated what time period it is, but we can see they have quote unquote thanked Papa Elon. So one could guess this is from Tesla, especially towards the end. And it does kind of follow the Tesla price pattern, which we talk about in loads of the other investing videos on Tesla. So we can understand that this person probably has invested in Tesla a lot, and that has been going up quite high recently. So that could have basically equated to this person catching such a huge profit and rise on their stock. So very good trade from this person. Very well done. We can see it's clearly gone up towards the end. Will it carry on going? We'll talk about that in another video. But that brings us on to our very third trader of the video. And this person again on Robin Hood looks like they have made 76.33% over the past week which is a very slick trade for a one week. Basically, this person's made 13,000 in one week, apparently started off with around 20 or even 18,000. Now they've got about 30,000, 30,774 and 24 cents. Very nice rise towards the end of this week. So this person clearly might have invested in Tesla again. They are saying no Zoom, no Tesla, couple of apples and more. So we can understand Apple is another stock. It's split and a lot of people got excited at that point. So that could have fueled this move. Again, this is 14 hours ago, so that would make some sense into the decision of why the stock has shot so high. But a couple of other stocks which this person hasn't talked about, but Apple and a few other technology stocks, again, I'm guessing because, as we know, technology stocks have been shooting up. However, a lot of people have been caught out today and yesterday, and that brings us on to our fourth trader. So get ready to see the, the first loss of this video, and there are going to be many to come. So let's just dive into this trader on Robinhood again, and this person has made a red. So you can see here this person is on Tesla, and Tesla has crashed today and this person made a loss of around 43.51 percent fortunately for them they only lost 19 dollars which is not too bad because i'm guessing that they must have invested in calls or something along that lines so they didn't actually have to pay for the entire stock very good decision to make if you don't have much money so this person has gone for a good decision in a bad situation being able to return some money and not lose too much. They've got $24.93 left in their account and they bought Tesla at $5.60 and then the price crashed from there. Very unfortunate to see that. However, it is only on the one day. So this person does still have the chance to make that money back, hopefully in the future. And I wish them all the best. Hopefully they can make that money back because if they could lose 43% in one day, that's quite tragic. And if technology stocks, quote unquote, bubble has burst, that would be sad. Now I did a video talk about bubbles and stocks on Tesla. So please do check that one out was you watch this one and check out any of the wall street bets series but we're going to move on to our next robin hood trader and this person is in the green once again so a very nice trade here 481 percent on one day now we're saying zoom is the one for this one as we know zoom the other day shot up by 50 percent in one day which is basically a huge rise for this person and this is equated to eight thousand dollars for this trader so very very nice and slick trade there absolutely fantastic look and this person has managed to pull off a great trade and make a huge profit very very happy for this person to have done that and they are once again on robin hood now this does appear to be a, a recurring theme on robin hood where traders basically report to wall street bets perhaps because you don't need as much knowledge but here we go another great trade in robin hood 500 almost with this person so fantastic for them now let's move on to our very next one 
Now, I can't lie, this person has got quite an unclear photo. However, they are saying that they've made thousands of percents in the one day, around 8,000% in total, and over 3,000% on the one day. Again, probably something like Zoom, to be honest. And I think it does say Zoom at the top, but right now, the photo is so unclear, I can't see it. But the person has apparently invested in Zoom. But let's move on to our next trader. And this person has apparently gone from 32,000 to 78,000 in two years. This is, once again, very lucky in the current situations, because some some stocks have shot up, some stocks have shot down, and this person apparently has caught a great stock which has gone up. So we can see here, max change is around $346,031.82, making them a percentage profit of 1,079.33%. Very large one over a longer period of time, looks to be around two or three years. So it's two years, like I say, but we can see over the last year, obviously it's started to pop off really and shoot up. And this is where the person is at now. Now, if this was me, I would personally sell. But what would you guys do? I don't know. Tell me down in the comment section. Tell me what you would do with this one. But I don't know. I'm, I'm guessing this person has gone for another tech stock again, like the previous, because technology stocks are a recurring theme in this video. Here we have another one, which is AMD. So I like this one. I may be MAD but def be AMD. Fair enough, and this person has made 277.13% on AMD stock and basically has caught a rise of $230,000 and more. So this person is once again up on a huge ride with the technology stocks at the minute and has caught a huge one with AMD, which as we know, has been a breakout stock during the current times. And a lot of people have been reporting great gains from AMD over this period. So very happy to see another AMD trader make a huge profit. And I'm starting to think, maybe should I do a little dive into AMD? Because it is one of them stocks where it could go either way. But with it being a technology company, we can see things in the future for this one. However, it is once again a very risky trade, but over a three-month period, it looks like, this person has managed to make a big pull-off, especially towards the last two months. So in recent times, this person's trade has started to pay off, and this seems to be a recurring theme with these tech stocks, especially, but with some other stocks as well. So let's move on to our, another loss. This person, minus 20000 Dollars, almost $21,000 in fact, very unfortunate trade, I'm not sure what platform this is, however, we've seen minus 65.41%, so that's absolutely atrocious, feel so bad for this person, that they have made such a loss, and you know, it's quite unfortunate, but these things do happen, especially on Wall Street bets, and this should be evidence to you guys of why you need to research your trades, and make sure you know what you're getting into, because some people just go into really risky trades, and basically you end up falling down huge profit ladders and go down and down and down and then they see a huge profit and then they don't take it thinking it's going to shoot higher and what happens is they just go lower and lower and lower and basically lose so you can see this person bought in for an average price of one dollar and six pence and basically sold out for 36 cents as well so very huge loss but we are going to basically make this up with a nice little gain in our next clip and this person is once again on robin hood so another Robinhood trader has managed to make a nice uh, profit fortune of 24.68%. Quite a steady gain. We're looking at a one week here. And this person is saying turned 75k into 325k, which is a very nice story to hear. Now this person has clearly made $64,000. To be exact, it's 64, 3, 7, 4, and 6 cents. So a very nice rise once again for this trader. Very happy to see this, especially being as this is a one week. So one week, basically a straight up line. Not really many dips downwards, but this person has managed to pull out with a nice profit. Now, I don't know how, if they have actually pulled out of this, but if I was trading with 60000 on such a large swing trade, I would be quite nervous. Will you guys hold this in, or would you sell it? I personally would sell it. But let's move on to our next one. Now, I would be interested to see what the state of this person's account is, being as they have posted this more recently, but it's not clear what day they actually took the screenshot on. But this person is stating huge returns once again on tech stocks. A lot of tech stocks we can see in there, and this is just the top of the list. I couldn't actually screenshot all the way down, but we can see things in there like Zoom, Amazon, you know, stocks that have been shooting up massively over the recent times. We can see one stock there is almost up by 700%, 656%, and all of these have made such a huge return as far as finances go so this person has made nine thousand on zoom three thousand on the next one and two thousand four hundred on the one after that all of these ones are in the hundreds of percentage when it comes to rise very happy to see this trader doing that and i'm basically pleased for them to see them make such a nice rise so we're going to move back onto robin hood and see what our second trader is about now i believe these are the more recent trades as tesla has actually crashed recently 
only slightly though, but this person is saying Tesla has been so good to them, reporting a one day massive drop off a cliff, and this is minus 47.79%, and it's actually quite a decent amount of money that they've lost here, so not one of the largest that we've seen in this series at all, but this person has actually lost $600, which is quite unfortunate and quite painful still, especially over a one day period, now is this person going to hold or not, that's what I want to see, because I do believe that Tesla has some potential to basically go even higher, even after this crash, because the stock split basically put a lot of tension into the market, but we'll just have to see the way that that moves with Tesla, and if this person holds out and is reporting a nice profit on Tesla in the future, or if they go for a further loss. Anyway, good luck to them, and we'll have to see where they end up. Honestly, one of these days I am going to have to make a losses and profits only video individually, but this person, another great trade until it fell off a cliff. So we're looking at one month and this person has lost 62% towards the end of that trade. Clearly just dropped off a cliff, absolutely. I'm saying this is something like Tesla and basically they've lost a lot of money. So we can see a quite gradual ride all the way up slowly and then it started to spike up then it went down and then it hugely spiked up i'm guessing this person got a bit too happy decided not to take the profits and then it went down so unfortunate but this just shows why you basically need to look at profit margins and why you should take them and that's why i've got a video on the channel talking about where to set take profits or stop losses but that's another topic for another video so let's hop back onto another robin hood account and look at this trader very nice hundreds a 30% rise for us here, 130.92% rise, this person has made $27,800 over the last day apparently, so another stock that shot up, probably something like Zoom, so it's actually Nvidia calls it says at the top, so this person has invested in Nvidia calls, and it's gone even higher, and this person has made a huge over 100% profit in one day, very nice to see, very happy. So I predict this trade is quite newbie as they have commented, am I doing this Tesla call thing right? This person profiting from a 25% loss actually. So this person has lost $1,200, their account balance is 3502 and they have caught a ride all the way down today. Obviously this is a more recent one from three hours ago from today and this person has been caught out in the Tesla crash and the Tesla price has gone down affecting a lot of traders on Robinhood and basically on Wall Street Bets too and here we have a loss. So it's very unfortunate to see that but it has been a very volatile few days and this is why this has been a very long a special episode because a lot of people have been reporting profits and losses. Anyway, I hope you enjoyed this one. If you did, please leave a like, do subscribe, and I will see you in the next episode soon. Goodbye.